And this specific model was why I joined the club entirely. And if you don't already know her, Kylie Parks, she's one of the top dogs, top contenders. She creates really pretty stuff and it's really appealing. I haven't disliked a thing that she's done so far. She's very, very sought after in the community and she's usually the winner of the best customs contest every year. That being said, she was hired by Briar to make a Premier Club model. And so I have intentions of leaving this guy OF to have in my collection because I really admire her, her work. So not only did Kylie Park sculpt this model, she actually painted it. And that was the first time in Briar Premier Club history that this has happened. That being said, next year's club, 2021, they have released the thumbnail for that and that is the Fireheart model. And it is also sculpted and painted by Raven Maddock of Chrysalis Studios. That's really cool because she's actually a pretty close friend of mine and she lives in Canada as well. So there's a big trend happening here of top dog artists completing sculptural and painted pieces for Briar. What an accomplishment for them. I'm like so proud of them. So I definitely want to have these models as a token of their milestone because I look up to them so much. Let's open it. It was supposed to be delivered on Friday and it made me wait until today. I didn't even change. I'm like wearing my scrubs from work. <laughs> they put it for whatever reason inside this box. It's a Canadian thing. I don't know. That's just how they do it. <gasps> it's so colorful. It's so bright. So she called this guy a troubadour. So there's the little back piece with Kylie there on the box. She's an incredible artist, but also like a really nice person. Like I've reached out to her many, many times and I'm kind of forcing her to be my friend in a way. I ask her a lot of questions and she's never once like sound annoyed or shut me down. So she's a really, really positive influence in the community. So I'm really excited to be supporting her in this. Situation. I really just hope it's a nice one because all the other ones actually this year have been nice. My first year was a disaster and this year was actually pretty good and I've been, I am joining for next year because I need Raven's horse which sucks because <laughs> it's expensive and I didn't want to join again. Good job. Bye. Okay. So there he is, Troubadour. He's really, really striking. Like the color is really fun. He's considered Silver Bay actually because he has the kind of silvering in the hair, but he's like a really rich color. And I wish Briar did more of these kind of basic colors, like a really rich buckskin or a really rich bay or just like something simpler with less snazzy markings, but the splash is really fun too. He has a blue eye on this side and a brown eye on that side, but I love this whole thing like happening. You can see there's pinking in there. So, so lovely. I'm definitely keeping him. He's not perfect in the sense of a live shower. He does have some flaws happening. It's really just about having this horse. It's not really about it being absolutely perfect, so I'm not too upset about it. That's Troubadour. I'm really excited for Kylie, and I'm really excited to have him in my collection, and it's inspirational to, you know, see these guys, and maybe hopefully one day sculpt for Briar. We'll see. That's Troubadour. I'm super excited for you, Kylie, and I can't wait to see him in other colors. I really want one in liver chestnut. <laughs> And yes, it is confirmed that I will be joining for 2021, so these videos will continue. That was a more successful year of, of collecting, and I actually have all three of these guys. So thank you so much for watching, and happy collecting.